but they probably played a lot, so I would assume it'd be fine. But yeah, I think this is one of Kiro's better matchups, or relevant matchups. Castle, uh, he took kind of a break last quarter after he got HM, I think, uh, Q4 of 2022. Started playing Pit and came back, had a better appreciation for Min Min. So let's see how his neutrals evolved. Game one, PS2. Yep, there's the Accelerado start. Ooh, did a side B2 a bit too close, but yeah, they're both scrapping a bit too close, which is a little weird. I know there's the there's the bounce, so you can't get Dragon Laser. Although I actually don't know, actually don't question me. I actually don't know if Dragon Laser gets deflected or not. But uh, pretty even game, slow start. Snook likes going for that shield poke setup. Get the fair and then just wait and see if he does anything so you can anti it or uh, go for the up tilt shield poke. But he didn't get it. Push him in the corner, his castle. What do we got? Ooh! Ram Ram didn't hit. But here's the chance for a combo. Um, doesn't get it, but still in the ledge trap situation. And that was unfortunate. Didn't get the second arm to swing in time. Um, yeah, one thing I'm looking at for is I'm going to see if Castle's going to get a grab because. From the min -mins I've played, he's usually more grab heavy compared to the others. Um, he's not the combo oriented uh, min min like uh, BC is. But he is pretty talented. He did get HM. Had a INC win. Yeah, it looks like Snooks just hasn't been able to get anything started. I, li I like that Tomahawk, but uh, didn't commit to anything. Just reset. Ooh, yeah, Megawatt at that percent is going to kill. Might have been slightly bad DI, but like. I don't think it mattered. Gets his Accelerado again. Yeah, I'm actually surprised. I, I thought this would be a matchup where you do more um, side B2. But I like that. Use Accelerado, dash back, dash in, and then uh, bait, it out the, bait it out the grab. And so what do we got? We got, oh, we got a, I got a person on commentary with me joining. Whoa, he got stuffed out. I didn't know Fire 3 could get stuffed out. What's up? Yeah, what's going on, man? It's combo out on here. Go ahead and fill me in. What's, what's going to happen? Uh, pretty slow start. Castle got a first stock. This is only game one. Um, I was expecting Snook to swing more with uh, side B2. Don't ask me what the names are, because I'm really bad at that. I don't have time to remember everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk about Min Min's arms. No, uh, heroes. I don't even remember half the hero spells. I don't even, I didn't even think they had names. I'm going to be completely honest. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> It, it's looking like pretty rough for, for Snook just getting in here. Obviously, the, the percentage isn't that far apart, but Ca Castle can just rack on so much chip damage with Min Min. Yeah. Again, I was surprised because like, you saw how he got that first like uh, 33%. It was, mo it was from that side B2. And now he's starting to do it more. Uh, I just feel like he could have been throwing it out a bit more often. Because like, he's getting these baits, like he's baiting out the spot dodge, but he's not really doing anything with it. And now he just went for the Haymaker, which... I don't know if it would kill with his with the buffs, but like, because Min Min's pretty heavy. So. Ooh, put that back in her. Yeah, I'm feeling like, it, just in this matchup, I think the reason he, he isn't going for such much side B is just uh, Min Min's normals are just faster than side B and can probably reach him faster. Like, that, he's definitely, like, Castle's definitely looking for a side B right now yeah. with those, uh, those fast arms going at him. Because I just always assume that, like, because, like, all those projectiles are getting eaten out by the arms, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm thinking if you do, like, a jump side B or a landing side B, right, you would intercept before the arms come out. And he's kind of going for it now. He's trying to get that snipe. Um, but, yeah, that, that was the situation I called earlier where, like, that arm edge guard, I don't expect Castle to kill off those situations. He just resets usually. Like, if it was BC. Ooh, but he got that one. I take it back, Castle. Oh. If you bought a review, uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I take it all back, Castle. Yeah, this matchup looks rough. I think Snook's got it down like with a with a mixing between using uh, his spells at at range and then coming in on platforms and using stuff like up these shenanigans that Castle may not be ready for. But it's, this is honestly very rough. The hero being extremely slow can't get in on Min Min like you want to. And he just he has to just get read after read to push to push Castle to the corner and then hope that he can get the Question, is this actually a bad matchup for Hero? Because I thought, like, out of the DLC, from what I've heard, Hero likes uh, Min Min and Steve. Those are, like, his two good matchups. 
and I guess uh, Sora later on. But th those were the like the DLC matchups that I heard he was good in. Obviously, I'm not a hero main, but if I had to guess, this looks awful for a hero. Cause because the Disjoints and Min arms go through spells. Hero can't get in unless he has Accelerado, and Side B is slower than the arms. I just feel like with the, how bad his disadvantages is, how bad his disadvantages, you do not want to be going up against a character like that. I mean, like, I will say that Snook is doing, like, fine with finding the hits, or, like, finding the opportunities. He's not getting, the, like, the meaty hits that he needs, though. He's just, like, getting, like, a 1-2. Oh, there, oh this that's going to be, be enough to take it. There it is. Takes the first stock this time. Oh, uh, Castle's just like, oh, snooze. Dude, getting hit by a snooze at 37 and just, like, accepting your fate. That wasn't even with any of the buffs, I think, right? That was just, like, just full charge up smash, no crit, no nothing. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Heroes attacks, like, even even though they're slow and... Uh, they just kill. Yeah, they, they did murder. That's one of the things, like, if I had to guess, because he had to get the read that Castle was going to not only be on the floor, but drop shield yeah. and just and take the snooze. Like, there, there's a whole much... I feel like there's a lot more that Hero has to do than uh, Min Min in this matchup. Ooh, I think he should still be alive. He's yeah. alive, but it's not looking good. With that Min Min ledge trapping, he's not. He's going to have a really hard time getting up on this stage. Gets back with the air dodge. Really good recovery, but that Ram Ram is going to be able to take him all the way down there. Gets Accelerado. Ooh, with five mana remaining, gets back on. That's oh, and exactly he's getting all his mana did. back. Yup, good wait. There it is. Can you get it? No. Yeah, like I said, once that Accelerado is online, this, this does become a winning matchup, I would say. Okay, so this is what, yeah, that's more of what I was expecting. Like, Accelerado and just, like, you gimp him. But having only only having good matchup for 12 seconds throughout the entire game, looking pretty rough for Hero. But for, Snook's doing a good job now that he actually has a lead. He's actually playing his percents well. I think yeah. maybe he just needed to slow down a bit. Because, again, he like, right there, he knew when to call it the grab. But game one, he just wasn't going for the actual hit. As in a crowd. lot of matchups, I think it's just uh, whoever wins is just dependent on who gets the first stock. I think we're seeing that a lot here because whichever one takes the first stock gets to play way more patient. Like having a minimum approach you is definitely what you want and probably makes this, like in this situation, I would probably say the hero would, would Like win. look at that. Just walks up, dashes back, and because he has a lead, he doesn't have to do anything special. Exactly. Yeah, Baited yeah. out like two or three different options, then found that back air. Nice and simple. But it's got to, it's a put out of that on grab. But it is definitely dependent on the first stock. Yeah. And this could be, ooh, he went for it. Yeah, I was. And he's still alive. He knew it would be safe to go for there. See, that corner pressure, just like I was saying before, you need to find those defensive habits that Min, -Min uses. And, and uh, Snook noticed, noticed that uh, Castle loves shielding. And he can just push Castle further and further. It feels like Snook's just doing whatever now, because, like, I have not seen him do, like, run up up tilt, like, the entire game. Mm -hmm. And he just was like, yeah, this is going to work. Yeah, see, d such good corner pressure. He knew it was either grab or shield, and he, he got that 50-50. So if I'm Castle here, like, yeah, I got three stocks, but at the same time, I lost the lead because I got snoozed at 37. Yeah, like... So, like, I'm not sweating too much. And it's hero, like, it's kind of expected. You can definitely run away with this match if... If you take the lead as hero, that might be why they prefer the the match in general. You know, you get lucky enough yeah. on the first stock, and you can just run away with it so easily because Min Min is forced to approach a, a character with as, as much damage as hero. Yeah, Min Min fighting out of the corner when she's down feels so sad compared to like when she's fighting in the corner when she's up. It is such a different story. Yeah, you you wouldn't think it would make a bunch of a difference, but it really does. Especially because when especially when she has uh, with those faster arms, I don't remember the name, but. She can only rack up slow, slow damage, and Hero can just make it all up in one, right in there. one combo like here, pretty much bringing it back. Yeah, I, I like the, I like the weight on like threatening Kaboom, but not actually doing it because again, uh, Min Min's arms have been stuffing it out, and if Castle's really worried, you can up smash it, or just hold shield it's super far away. Yeah, you definitely want to see if your opponent's prepared for it, and I, I think Snooks is doing a really good job at that. And, and there's that grab uh, I was talking about from Castle. He's, I think he's a more grab happy uh, Min Min compared to like the rest of Houston. Yeah, I mean grab for Min Min is definitely really good for her. Dragon Laser is a cheap mechanic. Ooh, g going for that up set up there probably wanted to smash attack out of it. Yeah, I think one of the reasons that heroes may prefer this matchup um, would be just because of how much respect Min, Min has to give for the spells so she can react in time. Yep. Uh, Hero just gets to buff himself up for free. Like, we, we're seeing, like, Excel Rottle and, and Oomph psych up and stuff like that. Uh, Ka uh, Snook can just kind of get it because Castle, if he approaches, he might just get hit with a Kaboom. 
and lose all that percent that he's been working for. That side be actually killing without a spark or anything. I wonder if that was bad DI. Yeah. That was most definitely bad DI. Yeah. I think Castle was trying to run away and uh, cut the dash back. It, yeah, dash back used the, those arms, but then got caught with that side B. See, now that uh, Snook has a lead, he's he's afforded the ability to play more grounded. I feel like whenever you're down, you like stop. You want to jump in a lot because you're just like, I want to make up this percent. But now that you're like in the lead, you're like most players' jump in habits aren't mm. nearly as bad. But like right there, Castle calling it out. With an yeah. up smash. I was just about to say, like, you definitely can uh, afford to be more grounded, but Snook did not care at all. He continued jumping in and racking up that percent. And like you, and like you said, uh, Castle just took advantage of it. The swag at 72! I wonder if he was trying to hit it with the arm, but, like, I don't know how the hurtbox amendment works, but, like, either way, he couldn't, like, get it, get the, uh, get out with the shield in time. Maybe Thwack uh, isn't able to be clanked with with the amendment's arms, unlike all of other all of the other hero spells, but that was absolutely tragic. But there's that Kaboom. He tried throwing it out, and nothing happened because Min Min Arm just like blocks it out. Castle's ledge trapping is, with Min Min has been super good, though. Getting that Nair, going for that really deep edge guard, though. Not going to be able to get it, and now he's in the ledge trap himself. That grab whiffing once again. There, that animation just definitely does not line up with the, with the hitbox on that. I think... I feel like Castle needs to, like, if he wants to get these grabs, he needs to, like, walk a little bit further. That went through that? Yeah, there's so many times where Castle's just, he's going for the right option, but he's just slightly misspacing himself. Here he gets that back throw. He's going to go Get for that really powerful back air, but Snook's ready for it, and he gets back on stage immediately with that Accelerado. But he has Dragon Laser for 20 seconds. Yeah, getting that buff up with Min Min is really good. Maybe go for it here. That was definitely looking for an opportunity there, but Snook knowing to get off that ledge before he can get hit by it. Oh, but smash right in the face. Going to be able to take that sock. Only 60% up on Castles. This this is anyone's game right here. Accelerado back online. He has, oh. he has that plus two matchup for, for 12 more seconds. I do like Castle jumping early because uh, he's avoiding the edge guard. Oh, good wait. Nice roll. Can we get it? No, we can't. Just reset to neutral. Yeah, Snook was catching Castle in his end lock, but now that Castle is in a ledge trap position against Hero without any buffs, this is looking pretty grim for Snook. Gonna have to air dodge back on this flat platform right there. Trying to reset the neutral, but Castle's running away with this advantage state. Oh? Oh, it didn't lock on. Yeah, go over the dragon laser. They're not gonna be able to get it. Snook rolling back on stage. Use, use that double jump. Castle wasn't able to burn it, though. Baiting out a jump. Didn't get it. Oh, oh. great spot dodge on that grab. Gets a forward throw. Now Castle's back in a ledge trap situation. Rolls right through that kaboom. Not gonna be able to take that stock right there. This game's gonna continue on game three. Let's see it. Good in there. What do we got? Both stuck on the platform. Dash stack off. What do we have? Ledge trap situation. Last stock, last hit. Any, <gasps> anything to break, but that Ray Ray's gonna be able to do it. Castle taking it 2 1 over Snook in a last hit, last stock situation. 60% comeback. Well, that was an incredible game. Mega Watt F tilt. Oof. Castle was definitely taking advantage.